There's three pawns on the same side. No. Yeah, what do you want? <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> Alright, hold on. Okay. <laughs> So I have a habit of playing new openings against strong players. <laughs> I'll take an opening I know nothing about and play it against the strongest possible guy. <laughs> and uh, the idea is I'm testing out my basically my th my series of chess. <laughs> like, do my ideas actually hold up, or is it all bullshit? You know. Right. So this this is called the Wade variation. Nice. Um. This is what uh, Jinji, Jinji was playing for a long time too, right? Oh, uh, was he? I I didn't know that. Oh yeah, he would play like I think Joel Benjamin tried it. You play like e six and d five. Yeah, yeah. Yep. I, I think there was like a queen b three moves at some point, but um. All right, so I'm just making up shit. <laughs> Kind of looks like a Rhett Langseth opening. Yeah. <laughs> so I played Rhett uh, on Tuesday. His knight went to c5 and took on e4. And I didn't see it. I, I'm losing my, my e pawns. Like, what the hell? What's wrong with me? Um, yeah. Okay. So we get rid of my good bishop. Nice. Then I get rid of my bad bishop. <laughs> I think it was Balashov that memorized every game of Bobby Fisher's. And yeah. he, he said something like, does anyone realize he never has a bad piece? <laughs> um, okay. So it's starting to look a little bit like Botfinic Tal. Where he puts all his pieces on the queen side and ignores the king side. Now it starts to look like um, Larson Fisher game four that I saw in person. Right. So it was around here that he offered me a draw. I spit in his face. I was I was literally channeling Bobby Fisher. So in my yeah. mind, I was like Bobby Fisher. So he offered a draw. I didn't even say anything. It's like no, I saw I saw Bobby crush Larson like this. I don't care who you are and who I am. Um, Offer me a draw when I have an open G file? <laughs> what are you thinking? And the thing is, a draw gives us $50. And a mm -hmm. loss gives us... No, a loss... Well, I mean, a draw gives us 50 and a win gives us 600 So the fact that he even begged for a draw, and the, mm -hmm. the computer said it was all even... This shows you like he was reading my body language or something. Um, so everything's a fishing pole in the final analysis. This is before I heard of the fishing pole, I think. Yeah. It's like 20, yeah. 21 years ago. Yeah. Um, so this is where Josh and I were cracking up laughing for like all the way home. You being cut out his <laughs> Yeah. You see and shout out his rock. That was the sorriest, oh. sorriest little piece. Also, he wrote a book on uh, just three pawns on the same side. No. Yeah, what do you want? <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> All right, hold on. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. <laughs> 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 so 
also. I need some context here. I'm a new viewer. <laughs> I'll show you who's on the line here. Uh, they're back. <laughs> hey, come on in there. Come on in. I'm doing a live stream, so. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. No bugs? No. <laughs> All right, I'm back. Okay. We're gonna have to do your uh, housekeeping over here, buddy. Yeah, I know. They came in here for uh, check for bugs. Oh, okay. I found the big one. Oh, okay. Thanks, guys. Uh, I'm cleaning this dump up. Please do before they. Something. All right. <laughs> Yeah, my place is subhuman. I haven't done dishes in like weeks. <laughs> uh, so uh yeah they do they do like random inspections. So far I've lucked out. <laughs> uh, random inspections, man. That's rough. Yeah, well it's like federal housing, you know. Right. Take you out for any reason. Basically, I've made zero friends in this building because it's just a, um, it's like a house of spies. It's like living in Hotel right. Moscow where every room is bugged. Right. <laughs> and I break the rules like on a daily basis. So I just, I just try to ignore all of them. I don't say hi. <laughs> I never invite anyone over. <laughs> I just avoid these spies like the plague. Treat them like uh, mushrooms. Feed them shit and keep them in the dark. Yeah. So, <laughs> uh... So, yeah. Okay. So, back to the game. So, yeah. it's Fee and Chattering his bishop, which is kind of pathetic. His rook, yeah. So... Uh, yeah, Fee and Chattering his rook. Um, okay, so I bring the last piece in. Uh, and I can't really calculate anything. Like, I don't know. It's like, I'm not really seeing any wins. Even when he resigned, I didn't see any wins. I think the computer says I'm like plus 10 by now. I mean, by then, by the end. Mm -hmm. Um, uh, let's see. I just keep building up the pressure. It's pretty sick. Basically, a human, if there's an open file against the king, they can't defend. <laughs> um, if he tries to trade one rook, pitiful. I like the rook that he's left with. <laughs> oh, yeah, so Donaldson had a book, three pawns on the same side each with knight versus bishop. So one of our joke titles was uh, like Rook and Three Pawns in the Same Side versus Three Pawns and Rook, Knight, Bishop, and Two Queens. You know? <laughs> um, all right. This is just getting totally ugly now. So the threat would be Knight C3 or Queen takes Knight on C8. Mm. Now I'm coming in on D4. Yeah, this is this is nasty. So he's actually like minus ten or something. I mean, just everything is just falling apart. So let's just make a random move. Um. Well, it's hard to even find a place for the king to go. What if he? What if he goes here? What do we do? Probably knight g3 check, I imagine, yeah. Just guessing. Um. Ugh. 
Oh, that's hideous. <laughs> it's freaking hideous. Yeah, it's like plus 10. <laughs> but he resigned. Uh, get wrecked. Yeah. Yeah, he resigned after uh, Queen D4 check.